Hello all, welcome to the special curated playlist on soft skills. So over the next few videos, I will explain to you what the soft skill is all about. So if you want to know more about all these things, you may please have a look at my new book. Uh, it's called Life Skills, uh, you know, the manual of critical thinking and soft skills. It is available over the Amazon as well as through the Amazon KDP. You know, that is basically the Kindle. If you have on a Kindle and you have a subscription to the Unlimited, you can download it for free of charge. You can just check it out in the Amazon. So what the soft skill is all about, as the name says, soft skill. So there must be something called hard skill, isn't it? Yes. So hard skill is something uh, also known as core competency. That is your expertise. That is your field of knowledge. For example, if you're a doctor, you know, then medicine is your core competency or the specialization therein. Uh, I'm a professor here. Uh, my core competency is molecular systematics, especially of marine algae. So that is a field where I specialized in. So then comes something called soft skill. What is that? Just the opposite of that, the hard skill versus soft skill. So soft skill is something which completely miss out in school curriculum. So the teachers in school as well as in higher education usually don't teach these things explicitly except if you are taking management courses. So soft skill is not domain specific but a set of skills which are really required for you to excel in your life. For example, creativity or motivation or how to manage time effectively, you know, so how to become a, a good leader, you know, how to manage the stress, for example. So what are the workplace ethics or work life balance, how to deal with procrastination that is just putting uh, off the things for the later and the, the tomorrow will never come, isn't it? And uh, yeah, so how to increase our personal productivity means we are supposed to produce something, right? Rather than simply consuming like scrolling through the, the Facebook or Twitter. So how do you increase that productivity and how to improve the communication in general? like active listening is a very important skill uh, that most of us are not even aware of it, you know? And uh, how to improve your written communication or oral communication when you're giving a public talk, for example, right? All these comes under the purview of soft skills. Other topic included in, includes the mentoring, you know? Or how to manage your emotions, emotional management, emotional intelligence, for example, how to increase your charisma, how to face interviews, how to write uh, uh, a CV or the cover letter, you know, or uh, how to take up the personality test and how to analyze the personality test results and how to tweak it to make improvements in your life, you know. So a lot of subjects involved, a lot of topics in, included in under the purview of the soft skills. So I will choose some selected topics and uh, we'll give you the crux of the subject over the course of next several videos, okay? So if you really want to take an in-depth view of all these topics, I did extensive research over the course of last one year. And I recently published that book, uh, which I just introduced, it's called Life Skills. So you may please have a look at that book and uh, see it, all right? So I will see you soon in my next video. Thank you.